All right, guys, let's try to bust out a quick unboxing before I chill out. I know you guys see this in the morning, but I record these the night before, and it's getting a little late, and I want to go chill. So let's uh, dig into this. There might be some things on top of the box. You might have seen my P.O. box address. If you're going to send anything to me, make sure you check with me before you do it, because if I get packages in there that I don't recognize or weren't authorized to be sent to me, they go right in the trash, right at the post office. They do not come home with me. So this was sent in by Michael. And uh, I know a lot of Michaels, so we're just gonna keep it at Michael. And there is a love note in there, so thanks for that. That's gonna make my life a little easier. And there you go, it is a Zin. And we're not gonna stop there, we're gonna open this box too. Now I know what this is, and I think I'll probably write in the title what it is, but you won't know until right now which actual model it is. Oh, there it is. This is my first time handling the Zen 104 and the white dial. And you guys know I'm a fan of white dialed sport watches for sure. So I have to say, I am digging it. Because I've handled so many Zen 104s. I mean, people ask me all the time about, you know, what watch should I get at what price range? If you're remotely close, plus or minus, to a Zen 104, just get a Zen 104. I don't care. Pick whatever colorway, or if you want the eye markers or the Arabics, just pick one and get it. Trust me, you will not be disappointed. They are a phenomenal watch, and they hold their value. If you are a serial flipper like I am, you're probably going to be okay. Now, I will do a full video on this. This one's on the leather, obviously. I would prefer it on an H-Link, but this is a really nice quality leather strap, too. And uh, they, the Zen 104 just works on so many different wrist size, guys. And that white dial is spectacular. It's going to make me weak. I know I can't afford to buy anything right now, but, um, man, it kind of makes me want a Zen 104. So there's a look at, you know, the packaging that it comes with and the Arabics, which I actually kind of prefer the Arabics, but that's a clean presentation on that white dial for sure. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next vid.